Independent supporters frequently ask me two questions about the EU referendum. The first is, how can you support independence and back Scotland's membership of the EU? Well, the answer to that is simple. I believe that independent countries must cooperate to tackle common challenges. Every member of the EU is an independent country working with others for the greater good. The second question is whether a Brexit vote will mean a second independence referendum. Well, here's what the SNP manifesto at the recent election said about that. The Scottish Parliament should have the right to hold another referendum if there is a significant and material change in the circumstances that prevailed in 2014, such as Scotland being taken out of the European Union against our will. Now, I'm clear that if Scotland does indeed face that prospect of being taken out of Europe against our will, then that option is on the table. But to be clear, that situation only arises if Scotland votes remain next week. If Scotland votes to leave, then that premise for independence doesn't arise. So I'll be voting remain for a variety of very good reasons. Access to a single market of more than half a billion people, free travel across Europe for all of us, and for the hugely important workers' rights and social protections that being part of the European Union guarantees. But if you're basing your decision on what it means for independence, let me be very, very clear. The only sensible and logical vote is one for Scotland to remain in Europe. If Scotland votes to leave, then our immediate future will be one inside the UK but outside the EU, at the mercy of a Tory government led by the likes of Boris Johnson, which is even more right-wing than that of David Cameron and George Osborne. So I ask you to vote remain on Thursday because it is in Scotland's best interests.